So the first thing on that pamphlet that we pulled out of the box says to dock the tablet and then plug it in before turning it on for the first time. But before we do that, let's take the tablet again, remove the plastic and look at the different ports. Now, the one thing that I love about this Acer tablet right away is that they send you to a website to have a Windows 8 tutorial, which is really cool, especially because with Windows 8 being a brand new operating system, people are not familiar with the different interface that Windows 8 has. So I think that's actually very thoughtful of them. Now let's do my favorite part about buying new electronics, which is pulling out the plastic. Too bad Milo the cat cannot be here today to eat this because he would love chewing it. Anyway, here we have some dock connectors that would go into that docking station that I showed you earlier. <clears throat> On the right side we have a speaker, micro SD for additional storage, this already comes with 64 gigabytes micro USB, micro HDMI, some volume buttons, power button, a lock, a headphone jack, and on the other side you have the other speaker, and that's it. On the back you have a camera with a flash, and in the front you also have a camera. So just like the Samsung tablet that I unveiled the other day you have front and rear cameras with the rear one having a flash. Now let's align it to the docking station before we turn it on for the first time. And this is very sturdy. It doesn't feel flimsy at all. And you actually have different options. You can use it like this, like a notebook or detached, like a tablet, or you can even flip it around to do presentation mode. Now let me just plug this into the wall. And now we can turn it on for the first time. 